Yes, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Gold's Bible. King Gamer here. This is your match reaction. Manchester United 1, FC 21. I mean, that's... I can't even say it, bro. Like, I can't even say it. It has gotten extremely bad right now. It has gotten extremely bad. Ten hack. He has to go. I mean, he has to go. This is now only three wins in eight or nine games we played this season in all competition. That is just not acceptable. We've invested a lot of money. The Inos have put a lot of faith on this manager so that they thought he could deliver something for Manchester United. But it's just it's not there. It's not there. I mean, we told a lot of fans. There were a lot of fans saying that Ten Hag should be given another chance under this new regime. He should be given an opportunity. He should be given time. Where are you now? I mean, where are you now this season? I mean, it's becoming ridiculous. It's becoming really, really ridiculous. Game in, game out. We don't play well. We don't perform. The performance is not there. The result is not there. And I don't know what the intention is with this, with this team. And you can't even expect a win against FC20. I mean, it's, it's, it's crazy. It's crazy. I mean, at the start of this match, everybody probably thought that we were going to go in and smash uh, FC20 by three goals or four goals, just like the other teams are doing. Arsenal, Liverpool, you're looking at the results here against West Ham, against Bolton. They smash it opponents. That's what big teams do. And we cannot seem to do that. We just cannot seem to do that. Every week there's a struggle. Every week there's a grind. I mean, you take a look at the lineup. You take a look at the formation. It's just none of it makes sense. None of it makes sense. I know some deluded fans are saying, oh, take Bruno off. Bruno's struggling. Yeah, but it's not just Bruno. The entire team was struggling today. It's not just Bruno Fernandes. I, I mean, I can barely mention one player that had actually a decent game. Who? Who actually had a decent game? Nobody. Nobody. I mean, you could say Rashford did some bits, but look, nobody really did anything in this match. And that goes to show you that it's not individual players. It's the whole team that is struggling. And there's no structure to our play. There is no patterns. There is no patterns of play. That's how you know this team is just not being managed correctly. And I do not know what they're doing in training because we don't see it. We don't see it in live games. We don't see it in games. We're just constantly suffering. I mean, I'm tired of watching Manchester United. I'm being honest with you. Like every single match now, when a game starts, it's like, oh, here we go again. Here we go again. That's, that's pretty much what it is, bro. That's pretty much what it is. But yeah, guys, let me know your thoughts. Let me know your thoughts about this game. I thought it was an extremely, really, really bad performance uh, from start to finish. I mean, we only played like the last five or six minutes, I would say. We put everybody forward. That's when we looked like we were going to score. But throughout the whole match, it was a slow-paced game. I mean, Eriksen scored a wonderful goal, but that was, only the, that was actually the only shot on target in the first half. So it just goes to show you, like, this team is not playing at all. It's just not playing at all. It doesn't matter who plays. Every player that comes in will struggle in this formation, in this system, under this manager. So, yeah, I've had enough. I've had enough of Ten Hag, and he needs to be sacked. He needs to be sacked tonight, bro. That's it. That's it. But yeah, guys, thanks for watching. Uh, make sure you let me know in the comment section what you think about the performance. Do you think you should stay? Do you think you should go? Let me know in the comments. That is it, people. Thanks for watching. See you guys on the next one. Uh, peace.